Hello and welcome back to Our Lady of the Woods. We're here with Claudette, Father Bob, and Hi everyone, it's Jason. Jason behind that camera. We're on our final, you know, mystery of the rosary, the glorious mysteries. And in this last moment, we have the fifth glorious mystery. And we're here in our chapel of Our Lady of the Woods Parish. And in the chapel, we have this beautiful statue of Our Lady of Lourdes. And Our Lady of Lourdes is a very beautiful reminder of the intercession of Mary. And Lourdes, if you've been there, have you been I to Lourdes? I have not been to Lourdes. I've been to Lourdes, and it, it was just a phenomenal experience. It's a moment for each one of us to bring who we are and where we're hurting and our frustrations. And I mean, thousands of people over the years have gone to Lourdes, to the healing waters of the beautiful grotto right there. And it's, it was just for me. I mean, I didn't get a physical healing when I was there. I got a spiritual healing. I went to the Sacrament of Reconciliation, which I hope you will remember to do at least once a year and when you're needing it. But for me, the healing came through that spiritual moment of knowing God really loved me and my heart was cleansed to try and do my best. And so today on this fifth glorious mystery, it's called the Coronation of Mary. Now the Coronation, that's a big fancy word. We don't hear about it in a lot of the states. Coronation has to do with a king or a queen, you know? And in a coronation, um, you know, where the king or the queen is crowned. And in this, the fifth glorious mystery, Mary is crowned queen of heaven and earth. What a beautiful time to take with her. When Mary entered heaven, she was welcomed by Jesus and the angels. And Mary was crowned queen of heaven and the universe. In heaven, she appears with a robe made of the sun, with the moon under her feet, and a crown of 12 stars on her head to remind us she's the queen of the universe. And here, we, what do we have around the base here, Claudette? These are wonderful little doves and a cloud that she's standing on. Oh, beautiful. And I like to think that these three doves could mean a lot of different things. We have the three theological virtues, meaning what we should strive to be if we want to follow Jesus. So we've got, I'd like to name them. If, we, if you ever come in here and you check with me, if I remember, I name these three doves faith, hope, and charity or love. Charity or love. And you can name them too. It could be a reminder of God as three persons, but one God. There's all kinds of ways you can remember. And I've been in here saying Mass for the last eight months you know, four times a week. And I never really noticed those three doves. So remind us in each of our own hearts that the Holy Spirit often in our Catholic faith is symbolized like a dove. And so we come now to the fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of Mary, the Queen. And we're going to have Claudette lead this decade. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. And today, because this is the final in our series that we've done, first of all, the Joyful Mysteries. And when do we say the Joyful Mysteries? We say the Joyful Mysteries on Monday and Thursday? Yeah, Mon Monday and Saturday, Saturday. Are the Joyful Mysteries. Okay. And then we say the Luminous Mysteries on only one day, Thursday. Thursday. The Sorrowful Mysteries. It would be Wednesday. Tuesdays and Fridays. Tuesdays and Fridays. I got her going here. The uh, Glorious they, Mysteries they are Wednesdays and Sundays. And they Wednesdays did change them. So we're going to say it one more time. The Joyful Mysteries are on Mondays and Saturdays. The Luminous Mysteries are on Thursdays. The Sorrowful Mysteries are Tuesdays and Fridays. And the Glorious Mysteries are Wednesdays and Sundays. Now we're going to close. We hadn't closed before with it, but since this is the end of our four different sets of mysteries of the rosary, we want to close with a very beautiful prayer to Mary. And it goes like this. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our light, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To you we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. So it's been such a blessing and such a wonderful time, even to be with Claudette and also with Jason, but with each of you in your homes. And we'll be looking at other ways as we get closer to Holy Week um, and uh, those different feasts of Palm Sunday and Holy Thursday and Good Friday and, and Easter. And we just want you to know that we're here with you. We pray for you. We love you. We want to stay connected in our faith formation we program. Do. And I know that Claudette probably wants to say a few words before we sing our final song. My only thing is, is I can't wait for us to get through this and be back together again so we can celebrate and sing and pray together in person. And uh, Jason, do you have any words to say at this point? No. <laughs> no. I look, for, I look forward to seeing everybody in church again. I, I miss our weekend, weekend liturgies. Oh, that's great. And so we're gonna close. We actually got the two songs. This is our final moment together for the rosary. So we're gonna do the famous song for the glorious mysteries, and then we're gonna do the one, you know the one I'm talking about. All right, here we go. Get ready. Feel it in your heart. Feel it in your body. Feel the beat. Get those arms ready. If you're seated, just get it ready anyway. Here we go. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory, children of the Lord. Let's do it one more time. You ready? You in it? Ready? Here we go. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory, children of the Lord. Now, you know, we can't close off this series of the rosary without our favorite song in faith formation. You know, sometimes there's someone who doesn't want us to love Jesus. There's someone who tries to... to 
take us away from Jesus and pull us away. And that person is who? Who do we think that is? Claudia? Satan. Satan. The devil. And even in Greek and, and Latin, there's the meaning of the word devil is really to scatter, to pull apart. And so we are about gathering and being together. So let's sing our faith formation song. You know the one. Are you ready? Shut the door, keep out the devil. Shut the door, keep the devil in the night. Shut the door, keep out the devil. Light a candle, everything's all right. Boom, boom. Light a candle, everything's all right. Boom, boom, boom. Shut the door, keep out the devil. Shut the door, keep the devil in the night. Shut the door. Keep out the devil. Light a candle, everything's all right. Light a candle, everything's all right. Light your candles, everything's all right.